reference photo of a rock in the water which you can kind of see in this frame and I just had four different colors and blocked them out on the page so there was one dark darkest color another dark color but was, which was a bit lighter and then I had the two light colors um, and obviously the lightest color is the highlights and where the sun is like reflecting but basically I just tried to simplify the process sometimes I think we or I try and hone in the detail straight away but if you just get down the simplified version and the shadows and the highlights it doesn't really matter how closely related it is to the reference it's more just blocking in those shadows and the highlights and the rest will come with it um, which this book really helped me and gave me practices in order to do so. A little study I did was on the light in the darkness. I always struggle with trying to paint images in the night time because I feel as though sometimes you can't get the exact colour but this again this image just throw it out it's not it's very messy it's it's quite garbage but it really helped me like see the light in a sense even though it <laughs> looks like a one-year-old did it it kind of helped me understand what kind of colours are actually seen in the night with obviously a cityscape or light. gave me some sketch references to draw and to hone in on my skill it really was talking about the anatomy and I guess the bone structure the body and the spine and how everything fits together and it was really just a quick reminder because there was a time where I really was into figures um, figure drawings and I would do figure drawings for at least 30 minutes to an hour each day because I really wanted to get better at them, I was really obsessed with it, and then obviously I stopped. But um, I bought this book to get back into it, just because I feel like it's a very good skill to have. And um, I want to definitely get a lot, lot better at figures, and so I'm trying my best in practicing, and this book, I guess, is inspiring me to do so.